Part 4. Set up backup wizard on your custom build skin on the AO1 Nox skin on Cody. And make sure you big thanks to Mikey1234 for the USB SD card wizard add-on. And make sure you visit Cody.tv for more information. What's up guys, it's XBM Connect here and this is part 4 of the AO1 Nox do it your own customized build um, on your system on your XBMC or Cody setup. Um, now that you've done all the, you've installed the skin, you've uh, done the menus and then the sub menus, and you've done the backgrounds as well, interchangeable or um, by changing it whatever category you want, and you've set all that up. Now it's time to actually um, use and create a backup so you could, um, if something happened to your XBMC, you don't have to redo it again, you just have a backup. Or if you want to uh, use this uh, build that you built, onto another device like uh, another Android box, tablet, iOS, or Windows, or a Mac. So it's um, whatever you want. So what we're gonna do is go to system, we're gonna go to file manager, and you're gonna click on add source. And then go ahead and click where it says none. We're gonna type HTTP two dot slash slash Xfinity dot Zunity talk dot com. And then go ahead and click done. And then at the bottom right here, press the period button and put Zunity Talk. And then go ahead and click OK. Now, just to make sure everything works, if you clicked on it, you will see all these things. If you don't see it, then you spelled the uh, spelled it wrong. You're gonna do uh, use the C on your button on your keyboard or hold down the screen or whatever you're on or the menu button on the remote and you're gonna go to uh, edit source and then from there you could edit over here so now that we completed that we're gonna go to system and we're gonna go to uh, add-ons and we're gonna go all the way down to install from zip file and then use the Zunity talk and then go ahead and choose Zunity talk repository now once you see the indication that it has been enabled, give it a few seconds as you see it on the top. We're going to go ahead and go to get add-ons and we're going to go to Zunity Talk repository and we're going to scroll down to where it says programs and then we're going to get USB SD card wizard. Go ahead and click on that and install. We're going to wait for that to um, actually finish installing or downloading. Now once it's enabled, um, go ahead and back out of it and go to your, uh, wherever you put your programs add-on is. Um, I usually put mine on apps, as you can see right here. And then just go to programs. And you're gonna go to USB SD card wizard. Now when you click on it, um, you have to set a storage path. So uh, go ahead and click yes. And for right now, I would highly suggest you go into just your just de desktop and go ahead and click OK or wherever you're comfortable with and you could just put it anywhere. I am using a Mac as you can see. Go ahead and click OK and then click OK. Uh, don't worry about the script failed. Uh, just let that happen. And then if you click on it, you're going to get backup or restore. Now before you do anything, um, go ahead and if you click backup and you'll have full backup and all these. Now, before you do a full backup, remember that you're going to be uh, loading the thumbnails, the metadata, and all these un other information, and your file is going to be at least going to be like 300 megabytes. Now, if you want it smaller than that to like 120, 150, or a lot smaller, then I could show you um, on how to do that. But... Um, if you're you're fine with it, well, I'm gonna show you right now. I'm just gonna go to programs, and we've already done it, and then backup, and then full backup. And then just let that happen. Now, by doing this full backup, remember when you transfer to another device, like. A Windows or an Android tablet your pictures backgrounds is not going to be there because of the path now the reason why I don't recommend you backing up the way I just did right now I just wanted to show you the process um, it's not going to show you the background it's going to be all messed up 
Uh, but all the add-ons and the menus are all going to be there. But the background, you're going to have to actually physically do it yourself again by going to system, go to settings, and doing it all over again. Because the, the background location is not where it was because I'm on currently on Mac. So if I go to an Android, that's not going to recognize it. So um, that's how you install the backup. And uh, you could actually do the restore thing too. I would highly suggest you install the Zunity Talk repository and grab the USB SD card wizard first before uh, backing the, uh, restoring it and you'll be restore and you'll have full restore once you have that as well. So we're going to go ahead and show you on how to actually have it um, install the skins and uh, the backgrounds as well and I'll eliminate uh, unnecessary files to back up. And always don't forget to add XBM Connect to all your social media.